Speaking of boxing super series, Josh Taylor won the boxing super series. Look at this dude! I um, thought you had some good. I thought was, you had some shit for me. No, that was Man. perfect. In my opinion, no, I thought I thought you was like, "Hey, uh, Sean fighting this date." No, yeah, who knows when he's fighting? <laughs> I know, yes, yes, yes. But the uh, I, I know when I'm fighting. Yeah. Oh, you see how these dudes fans? We have no clue. Yeah, we don't. And I'm not positive he does either. I ain't gonna front. <laughs> I ain't gonna front. I just got the call today. I, uh, go. I just got the call a couple hours ago. <laughs> hey, oh, hey, Sean. I may have stopped. Oh, man's man like, about to go crazy. Yeah. <laughs> Common's about to go crazy. Yeah. You fight? Um, <laughs> yeah. Be, okay. Fair enough. Right. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> my bad. My bad, Carson. No, 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 no. You're good. I, I just, I know he's not gonna elaborate on it. So I'm not. I'm not. <laughs> yeah. So back to my perfect Josh Taylor transition. <laughs> we talk about big fights, unification fights. Mm-hmm. This one next weekend. I'm going to hype about this hey, one, it? Hey, this one has a lot to live up to. Because yeah. last night was good, man. No, no, no this is going to live up to it. Yeah, this yeah one, I know. This I'm one's going to be, this yeah. one's going to be dying. What somebody get stopped in the first? Ooh. Do you know where this fight is going to take place? It's here. It's here in the back. Oh, it, 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 we going? We going? Not at MGM. It's at, um. Manly? Now, nah, Vir- Virgin something, Virgin Hotel. Oh, it's the Hard Rock. They Hard Rock got bought out. Oh, yeah. Cool. But yeah, it, no, it's here. Uh, I, I think it's limited attendance, which is disappointing for as big of a fight as that one's going to be. But um, really good fight, Jose Ramirez and uh, and Josh Taylor unifying it at 140. I think the first thing I thought of when I was thinking about this matchup for today, they're both older than I thought they were. <laughs> it's <laughs> random. Was but it I just 30, 31, 30 and 28, I believe is their ages. I just I don't know why I picture them still younger than that, but. <laughs> That, you talk about a fight that's just, there's no way it's not action packed. Yeah. Just that one. Like, yeah. neither of those guys is not in action packed fights. And it's going to be, it's going to be a big one, man. I love every ounce of this fight. You have to, yeah. I love that both, both of them are offensive technicians. Mm-hmm. Both of them have g- great feet, can move and get around the ring, do what they got to do. Speed, power. The power the whole nine, you know, Josh Taylor. I, I really like Josh Taylor. I, Carson, you probably know that. I shared a few rounds with him in the ring back yeah. in like 2016, maybe, give or take. And um, we we even back then, we being myself and my dad, thought that this kid was like, oh, you know, very eyebrow raising, you know. Yeah. So uh, I'm excited for that. Uh, of course, uh, Ramirez being an Olympian and, and I mean, kind of just kind of blowing up on the spot as soon as he as soon as he turned pro. Um, this is gonna be a great fight. And he was he was considered like one of the prospects when he came into the sport. Like he was yeah. like he quieted down prospect. just a little bit, you know. Yeah. But then but he was, and, yeah. yeah, came in and did the damn thing. Yeah, when he I'm, came I'm in, going he, with the tur- the tornado over the are you the Jaguar? That's the alien. I'm I'm going with uh I am we if we want to skip to that, I, I'm going with Taylor. Um I just think he's Offensively, I think he's a little more tight offensively. I just think he's got he's a little hey, just technical. just a little bit. Just a little bit. This is a fight where it's like yeah, that this fight is. Do you see that though? Like <laughs> I, I like think being tighter, you know what I mean? Yeah, I think I think he's a little crisper offensively. I also think they're both very good body punchers. I think Taylor is a better body puncher. So and let me ask you this real quick: when yeah. you call it, when you talk about a fighter being crisp offensively, what what do you see in a fighter being crisp? I would just say not wasting a lot of punches. And also I think the speed and the power just, it's not, there's not a lot of like wide punches where you're like, Oh my gosh, like you're wasting this. Like, what are you doing? I think he's, (laughs) he's very a to B. Like yeah. kind of like Floyd was, was with punches. Yeah. He, he just, you're not wasting. I I think Errol is as well. That's another guy that comes to mind. He's, he's very hands thrown. It's landing his back. I think that is just, He's just very crisp, very efficient. So I like to get some. I like to from time to time, like show y'all, show y'all knowledge. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So <laughs> we're knows I tell, but yeah, we're, yeah, we're out here. Oh, so, no, no. Hey, yeah, shout he, out uh, to Sean. Yeah. But <laughs> um, yeah, no, I, I think, I think Taylor gets him, but I think, man, if you watch, if anyone is not sold on Jose Ramirez at all, watch what he did to Maurice Hooker to stop him. Yes. Cause you talk about, seeing an opportunity we've mentioned that with bud before where he uh-huh. sees you wounded yeah it murder she wrote yeah it was hooker he caught him with a shot and wobbled him 
I don't know how many punches he landed after that, but he jumped on him and he fired crazy punches. I was like, <laughs> that was one where you see the ref, you're like, hey, hey, step in. Come on, man. What are you, what are you doing? But, yeah, that's yeah, going to be fun. Don't tell me you didn't enjoy what you saw because I know you did. What you need to do now, hit that subscribe button, hit the like, hit that notification button. Check us out every week, every Tuesday, something new for you right here on the Port Away Podcast.